today we'll experience the importance of showcasing voice and style in your writing. Developing a unique voice and writing style is vital for authors. It sets us apart, captures our readers' attention, and creates a memorable reading experience. So let's delve into why voice and style are significant and offer guidance on how to nurture and refine them. There's a lot of moving parts going on with these two concepts. I've had the privilege of taking classes with several New York Times best-selling authors and I've heard that we generally don't find our own voice until we've written at least 500,000 words, which is probably why the average number of books the big time authors write before they kind of seem to hit success is like three or four, sometimes five or six. Tip number one, read everything, read widely. Expose yourself to different authors and genres. This broadens your literary palette and helps you discover what resonates with you and what you aspire to achieve in your own writing. Second tip, write regularly. For me, this means daily. I've talked about this in other videos. I have to write every day. Practice is key to developing your voice and style. Write consistently and explore different topics, genres, and perspectives. Embrace experimentation and allow your voice to evolve over time. Third tip, be authentic. Don't try to mimic some other writers or force yourself into a certain style. Embrace your unique experiences, personality, and worldview. Your voice and style will naturally emerge as an honest expression of who you are. Tip number four, edit and revise consciously. Pay attention to your writing choices during the editing process. Refine your sentences, experiment with different structures, and polish your work to align it with your intended voice and style. Personally, I've been able to accelerate my writing style by hiring absolutely terrific editors over the years. Tip number five, seek feedback. Share your writing with others and invite constructive criticism. I know this is probably counterintuitive to most of you, but feedback can actually provide valuable insights and help you identify areas where you can further develop and refine your voice and style. Never ever get upset when someone criticizes your writing because usually they're just trying to help and nobody, remember this, nobody writes perfectly on their first drafts. As Hemingway said, the only kind of writing is rewriting. So. When it comes to showcasing your voice and style, remember to read widely, write regularly, be authentic, edit and revise consciously, and seek feedback. Embrace your uniqueness and let your voice shine through in your writing. Thanks for watching and happy editing.